What is up YouTube and SC Studios fans? I'm back for another video. It's been such a long time. And I just I just decided to make this because I haven't made a tutorial video in a bit of time. So today we're gonna make a video on how to make a random pile of random objects. So in this case, I'm gonna make a pile of parts, but if you want, you can make it coins or spheres or whatever you want it to be. So to make the part like a bit more interesting, we're gonna make it a cube. And the special part about the pile is that you gotta make like a lot if you want it to be like a good pile. So you can just do it like how I'm doing it right now. Then you gotta duplicate this, look at what I'm doing, control D. And then you gotta move it up and then rotate it. And then so on, depending on how many parts you want in your pile. So once you've done that, you have to unanchor these, and in this case they already are, and also put on can collide so they just literally don't clip through the base plate. So, now just play here, and it should fall randomly into like a pile. So, as you can see, there's a pile of parts, but this isn't that good of a pile. So, if you want to add more of a pile, then you can actually select this in the, uh, in the testing phase, then duplicate it, and then like lift it up or something, and then there you go, it's a pile of parts. So as you can see, this is the testing phase, not in the building mode. So how do we do that? So first, we gotta select all these, then we gotta copy it, control C, then stop, and then control V, and then paste it in into the edit mode. So if you don't want people kicking this around, then press anchor, and then press group. And you have like a basic, uh, like, like pile of parts or anything like that. So if you found this video useful, then make sure to drop a like. Also, if you found this video extremely useful, then also su subscribe to this channel and join my server. That, that would like help my channel a lot, like a lot. And make sure to check out my next upload. As always, I'll see you next time.